Hey guys, it's me, Mr. D50, and welcome back to Mega Man Battle Network 6. We're gonna go to bed. Huff, 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 huff. Oh no. Computer dreams. Huff, 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 huff. Whoa. Oh my god, what's that? Gasp! Screech! Roar! Screech! Oh my god, I'm on internet fire! Help me land! 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 Uh, Mega Man! Mega Man! Land! Land! Mr. Landikari! Slam. Mega Man. Huh? Uh, Mr. Muck? Sorry, my nappy was on internet fire. Had a bad nightmare? Well, it's safe now. By the way, Lan. You want to join the class again sometime and study English? Nope. Foreign language. Your punishment for sleeping in my thrilling class will be you after school writing 30 vocabulary words. 100 times each. When you're done, you'll bring me your notebook. I'll be waiting for it in the teacher's room. You won't be going home until you're done. Is that clear? Yes, Mr. Mock. Whisper, whisper. Fuck. Ow. You should have woken me up, Mega Man. Believe me, I tried. But you just wouldn't wake up. Hmm. I don't have time for this. Let's get out of here. And so, after school... Finally! 30 words a hundred times each. That's 3,000 words. I feel like my arm's gonna fall off. Good job, Lan. Okay, let's go show your notebook to Mr. Mock. Yeah. Oh, my neck's all stiff. Oh, man, we've got fake mail. Director, hello, this is Director of Seaside Aquarium. Thank you very much for the other day. I didn't get the chance to thank you properly. So to say thanks, I wanted to send you something special. I call it the tag chip system. It's what it sounds like. It lets you tag up two chips. For instance, you can tag Sword of the Area Grab. Then when Sword appears on the custom screen during battle, so will Area Grab. This lets you make combos even easier. Let me tell you how to set up a tag chip. Go to the folder edit screen, press select. This will take you to the tag chip selection screen. On that you can select up to two chips to tag up. However, the chips that you can tag must add up to less than 60 megabytes. Remember this limit. You should definitely master the system. Oh yeah! Plata is anxious to see his two friends. Don't forget to stop by the aquarium. Alright. So, I'm not super familiar with this one. The obvious one is area grab plus sword. So I guess we'll set that up for now. So when one of them comes up, the other one will also come up, apparently. Fair enough. Imagine, like, Mega Man's, or uh, Land's surprise if we just, like, dropped him, like, a whole gig of RAM. Be like, what? I can customize everything. Everyone be careful on your way home. Oh, you really put a lot of effort into this. I've been waiting to see how you do. I hope you've learned there's no sleeping in class. 
Yes, Mr. Mock. Good. Glad you understand. You know, people make mistakes all the time. But we've got to keep moving forward. Ha ha ha. Yo! Oh, perfect timing. Why don't you come on over here? <gasps> Gasp! So you're the new student teacher. Nice to meet you. The name's Mr. Match. Mr. Match, huh? Cool name. Mr. Match? Where have I heard that before? Ah, uh, it's you, Match. What are you doing here? Now, why is this kid's voice kind of familiar? Heh, <laughs> but isn't little Lanikari. You two know each other? Yeah, he's a bad guy. Yeah, that's right. I've known this kid since he was small. He's practically my little bro. Little bro? What are you... <sighs> Relax, I'm not up to anything. Starting today, I get to teach you kids and do some research for school while I'm at it. Uh, it's not a great place or nothing, but I'm in college now. So, what exactly are you researching? What am I... Don't you already know? Fire, it's fire. I'm trying to make a system that lets any Navi use fire. Huh. So that's what you're up to. Hey, don't give me that look. I meant what I said. I'm gonna put my... All I've got into this. Oh yeah, Lan. I want to show you something after this. I'll be in the lab in the back. Pop in before you go, okay? I'll show you how a pro handles fire. Oh, look at the time. I've got to get going now. If I'm even a second late, my wife gets really scary. Ha 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 ha. Hi, honey, I'm home. Bye, Mr. Mark. What are you really up to, Match? What am I up to? I already told you. Nothing. Just go and get your stuff and come see me, alright? I can't remember if this is the point that I think it is, but if it is, we get a really cool power. I'm not sure, though. I can't believe Matt's is going to be my teacher. But maybe he's really turned over a new leaf. Guess I'll give his class a try. Looks like today's a good day for studying, huh, Liam? Ha <laughs> Yeah, and I'm ready to learn. Let's go get my stuff from the classroom. What stuff am I getting? I'm hungry. I want to go home now. Hold on, just a second. Your character portrait literally has like a box of fries. And I can see it on, like, your in-game character model, too, or sprite, or whatever they call that. <gasps> Gasp! It's that girl again. You're... Uh... Are you a student here? Uh, I almost forgot. Thanks for the other day. You know, for pointing out that copybot to me. But what was the copybot doing there anyway, I wonder? So, do you like fish? You were looking at them that day too. Fish. To take them out of the water. It's wrong. Fish belong in the sea. Can they really live on land? I'm Iris. Iris, huh? I'm... Lan, right? Thank you for saving me that time. Wow, you remember. I'm glad you remember me. So, what were you saying just now about fish? Nothing. Sorry, I'm asking a lot of questions, but... Which class are you in? You're not in this class, are you? I... I... Uh-oh. Emergency phone call. It's your autophone, Lan. Hey, Lan. How long are you going to take? Uh, sorry, Match. I'll be right there. Sorry, but I've got to go. Let's talk some more next time. Nod. See you later. I'm just a pointless story character. 
So it'll show up randomly until, I don't know, I give you light errors or something. I don't know. Uh, teachers in this, uh, use this computer in this room for research. It's running an OS you've never seen before. Important pales, papers are piled up on this bookshelf. The sliding doors are locked tight. The two stools connected together here. This box. What could it have? New materials for class. Computer's taking a long time computing something. Or it's frozen. Oh, hey, Lane. Okay, let's get my awesome class on the road. Don't hold back on me. Heh, <laughs> don't worry. I won't. I'll show you. When you go up against fire, you're in for one hot battle. Oh, yeah. Hey, do you know about the cross system yet? Alright, so I think we do actually get the cool power-up now. Cross system? Uh, nope. Okay, listen up. The cross system is the newest thing. With this new technology, you can take one's Navi skills and let a different Navi use them. So basically, with this system, Mega Man can use Heat Man's flame skills. Cool, huh? Yeah, that's pretty neat. But to be able to get that other Navi's power, and make it your own Navi's, gotta learn the basics of that skill. So this class we're having is for me to learn the basics? Bingo, kid. Well, when it comes to fire, you're the expert. I'm sure we can learn a lot. Let's give it a shot, Mega Man. Sorry, kid, but in this class you can't use Mega Man. Instead, I'm gonna let you use Heat Man. What? Heat Man? You want me to... Yep. If you want to learn to play with fire... Nothing beats using a real bona fide fire navy. See that comp? Heatman's in there, so go give it a try. Oh, before you do, take this. Land got school P code? You need that to get onto the net. Okay, now let's uh, go stand in front of that computer and let's burn. Guess I'll give it a try. Hey, Lanikari! I'll be counting on you, kid. I'm always in this computer, so if you ever need me, I'm here. Uh, okay, thanks. And it's great to be partners with you. Alright, girls, if you're done yakking, let's get started. Okay, best way I know to learn the basics is to just do it. Now, in Central Area, I left you a few of these guys. These are kettle viruses. You can't hit them with anything other than a fire attack. But you boil them right up if you use a fire-based attack. And what temperature does water boil at? 100 degrees Celsius. So if you use a fire-based kip on a kettle, you'll do 100 damage to them and get them real steamed up. Okay, I get it. So I've got to delete all the kettles on the net. Too easy. Easy, huh? Well, so you know, there's one in Central Area 1. One in Central Area 2 and... Two in Central Area 3. Beat them all and we can call it a day. Alright, let's try our best heat, man. Okay, it's time to fire it up, kid. Everyone loves fire... Fire puns. Man, wah! Okay, so we get a regular... A regular chips to use. I am the program in this computer. This computer is packed with research data. Thanks to that, I too have become quite intelligent. There's absolutely nothing I can't figure out myself. So we get to use Heat Man for a bit, which is kind of exciting. Heat Press, what is that one? Oh yeah, he gets a really legit flamethrower too, doesn't he? He 
amazing. He's got more HP than Mega Man does, so that's cool too. Fire hit 1F. Oh, right, those things. Ah, but he's got a weak buster. So basically, charge attacks are what you want to use with him. Alright, let's start looking around. You look like you're really on fire, Mr. Navi. Would I get burned if I touched you? Fire puns! <laughs> wow. Easily delete everything. It is weird that he doesn't have feet, though. Yep, nothing out of the ordinary. This patrol is really a pain. So it's going to take me a little bit of work. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I just saw a virus that looks like a kettle. Weird. Hot, hot, hot! Don't get too close! Is it down that pathway? Yeah, it just deletes everything. Of course, they're, uh, they're fire enemies, so I guess that makes sense. Where's Kettle Virus? Did I miss it? Okay, apparently I totally missed it. The <laughs> land should be burned out of here. It was right in the net cafe. See, they started mentioning the kettle virus, so I was like, oh, maybe it's down that way. No, it's right here in the cafe. There it is. There's a kettle burning for a fight. Fire up the battle. Let's light this guy up. Alright, so you gotta get him to 100 degrees Celsius to my understandings. My understandings? That's a little harder than I thought. I think you kind of need to hit him with like a combo here. Let's uh, let's retry this battle. I can hit him with the Mega Buster and then with that special attack. Oh, 
It's not quite fast enough. There we go. You just gotta be really quick on that charging, I think. And like, let it go the second you got it charged. Alright! You're getting the hang of it. Land cleared, or you cleared level 1, land. And move on to level 2 in Central Area 2. Give me my internet copy. Never seen you before. Okay, that was helpful. Thought you were going to tell me cool stuff. Alright, let's, uh... Buy one more full energy. Hello! Welcome to another peaceful day in Central Area 2. guy is. We'll just have a look around, I suppose. I will tell you, that chip does make defeating enemy navvies a decent amount quicker. Or enemy viruses. Just because you can spray a huge area with fire with that. Putting him straight on like the, the path to get in. I think it's two squares in front of the circle works. I'm done shopping, now what should I do? Yeah, they just put him right in the in the path. I thought they'd put him on like a weird random side path. Okay. Oh, I bet that Mega Buster extra damage would do something. Oh, okay, cool. Double damage makes that chip do even more heat damage. Okay. Wow, better than I expected. Hey, Lan, you got through level two. Next is level three in Central Area Three. There's two kettles in Central Area Three, so better get burning. I think I'm really beginning to get the hang of fire chips. Welcome. This is Central Area Three. Hot, hot, hot. really is a huge hole. At the bottom of this hole, there's an area called the Underground. There's a legend that says Psybeast are sleeping there. I wonder if it's true. Put that cyber tree in the way. Well, there's one kettle. Heat things up. Alright, double kettle. So, if possible, we should see if we can get a counterattack on this enemy right here. Alright, cool. So, I should be able just to one-shot this with double damage then.
did it! Ha! Pretty cool, Lan. Handling fire almost like a pro. That was level three, Lan. Last one coming up, level four. The last kettle somewhere in this area. Almost there, last one, let's go. Got it there. Do I have the unlocker? No, I don't. Dang it. Goodbye, enemies. You can't get too close to that huge hole. Psybeast might eat you. Ha ha ha, just kidding. We should probably put some railings on the slope. So the back one I can't hit with a charge attack, so that one we might want to be a little more thorough on. Yeah, the extra damage I think is helping that a lot. It's like 50 instead of 40 or 30 or whatever. Yeah! Hey, I think you've got it, kid. You may have passed level 4, but can you pass the final exam? Get ready! The final? Bring it on! Jack out, Heat Man! Okay. Time for the final test. The test is a net battle with Heat Man. Of course you'll operate Mega Man. You should have figured out how to use fire by operating Heat Man, right? So fire attack shouldn't be a problem for you. Alright, let's go. Are you ready? Let me save real quick, just in case. Let's go! Time for the final test! Start! And we're gonna wreck him with Bubble Star here. That helps him nothing, but we'll get rid of that chip anyway. Got him! Whoa, how do I, how do I dodge that? Oh, I think I gotta go between the waves. Hold on, hold on a second. We're getting a little crazy here. Alright. Oh, I can't even use those chips at the same time. I didn't even realize. Take your 10 damage. Yeah, you gotta go between the waves, that's how that works. Alright then. Got him! 90! I'd say this game is maybe a tad bit easier than some of the other Battle Networks. Because, uh, I haven't really been, like, super challenged so far. And I, I want to say that's, like, kind of par for the course of when I first played it, too. You impressed me, kid? What a red hot battle. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I mean, you're no pro like me, but you seem to get how to use fire now. Lanikari. Congrats on passing your final exam. For passing, Heat Man's gonna be one of your Link Nabbies. Heat Man became Lane's Link Nabby. I don't even know what that means, but I'm gonna pump my fist. Yeah, uh, Matt, what's a Link Nabby? Hmm, basically, 
Heat Man's linked to you, kind of like how Mega Man is. That means you can operate Heat Man anytime you need to. I can operate Heat Man anytime? Yep. You've earned that right. You've taken my class and learned the basics of how to operate Heat Man and how to control fire. And one other thing. Because you've learned how to control fire, Heat Man's power has been building up inside of Mega Man. So you should be able to pull a Heat Cross now. Mega Man's been gaining Heat Man's power? Can I really build up that kind of power? Because I don't feel any different. Heh, <laughs> guess so. Guess you're only going to know if you see for yourself. A battle? Hold on, let me get ready. Stop blabbering, I've been raring to battle. Uh, okay, you ready Mega Man? Yeah, let's light this arena on fire. More fire puns. Activating the cross lets you use a Link Navi's power. Once you link, you'll stay that way during the battle. To link, press up on the control pad when selecting the chip on the custom screen. And select a Navi to link with on the cross select screen. Go on, give it a try yourself. Yeah, so this is kind of the big thing that uh, is like the new thing for this game, and it's really cool. Okay, that's how you activate a cross. Now, try it out. Heat Cross will launch a firearm three panels forward when powered up. Fire chips that don't dim the screen will also get attack plus 50. Not to mention that the Buster's attack will be plus one. <laughs> so yeah, this is super cool. He gets a flamethrower. Extra damage from fire chips that don't dim the screen. And it only gets better from there. Got a grip on this yet? Using cross to link with a Navi will give you its power, but you're gonna have to keep track of a few things. You take double damage against hits that exploit your weakness. As well as break your link with the cross. In this case, Heat Cross is weak against Aqua. No matter what cross you use, be aware of its weakness. So, yeah, that, that's kind of important. Because, you know, you'll lose it, and then, if I understand right, you can't reactivate it until the next battle. So if you're in a boss battle and you lose that Heat Cross, you don't get it back, I think. So, just something to keep in mind. Think you got the hang of the cross system? All that's left now is for you to fine-tune it in battle. Oh, whenever you want to operate Heat Man, just come here and use that comp, okay? Okay, thank you, Mr. Match. Heh, <laughs> you're treating me like a real teacher. It's kind of strange. I think it's time to go home. Uh, yeah. So that's really cool, though. That's, sig that's a significant upgrade to the battle system. And like I said, it only gets better from there. Look at all those people. Wonder what's up. Isn't that Cab and Mick? Let's go ask them. Yo, Mick, Tab, what's going on? Looks like that chick's doing some sort of promotion. Looks like you're just in time. Huh. Sounds kind of interesting. Hello, Central Town. And how is everyone doing today? I'm pleased to announce that at this time tomorrow, we'll be holding a special Compu Dancing Jamboree. It's Central Area 3 to celebrate the opening of the Expo. We're going to be giving away great gifts and prizes. So tell all your friends, the more the merrier. A Compu Dance Jamboree. Sounds kind of interesting. Also kind of weird. Want to check it out if you got time? Yeah, sure. Tomorrow, huh? Logs, you don't get detention again. Hey, today was a fluke. Uh, tomorrow... My family's chip shop is reopening today. I have to work so I can't go. But even though I can't go, I hope you'll come to my store to stock up your chips. Uh, I'll come and buy a few chips, so, uh, don't worry. Uh-huh. Okay, I'll see you this time tomorrow in Central Area 3. 
Roger. All right, see ya. Hey, Tab, let's get out of here. If you want, you can come visit my store after this. Bye. Guess we should be heading home too. I hope to see you all there. Oh, gasp. You got mail. Let's check out the email. Let me tell you about Heat Cross. You got Heat Cross activated fire chips that don't dim the screen. Get attack 50 and the Mega Buster gets attack 1. Aqua attacks do double. Alright, let's check out the chip shop real quick. It seems the chip shop is open. I can hear lively voices inside. There's also a creepy man behind the store still. Got unlockers though. Alright. I guess you can get rare chips at a chip trader, but there's also a chance you'll get some boring chip. And three chips for one is kind of a bad deal. Also, when you use a chip trader, it automatically saves, so you have to be careful. And never, ever accidentally insert a rare chip. Ah, uh, just thinking about it gives me the shivers. Yeah, but we have the power of emulation, so we can just, like, save state anyway. Alright, so number trader is that thing where you can get numbers from in the game and I think from like out of the game. Like that was like a big thing in Japan or something was like events you could go to and get new number chips or something to get cool chips. So I don't have any of those but maybe we'll get those. And three chip traders so the idea is you can throw in three crappy chips and maybe get a good chip. Coming road, pull an enemy to the front. That's actually interesting for sword attacks. Flash bomb one. Third delayed stun bomb, three spheres forward. I have a lot of these chips I don't need. Long sword. Yeah, let's go for that one. That's a good one. Usually the chips you have a lot of are the ones you don't need. <laughs> Although these aren't really giving me anything good either. Ooh. That's a that sounds like a nice one though. Cup 50, not bad. Crappy barrier. It's row two panel ahead with sunshine. I don't know what that does. Bunch of mostly crappy chips that I don't need, so I don't mind getting rid of them. That sounds good. Eh. Okay, now we're getting to two, so I need to be careful what I'm putting away. There's still a lot of bad chips here, so I don't mind getting rid of them. Damages enemies with corn? Why? Alright, that's not bad. Okay, now we're back to bad. Cannon, cannon, and... Crappy barrier. 10 damage barrier is like nothing. Spreader, spreader. We'll get rid of a thunder. I think that's good. Oh, excuse me. I think that's good for that. Let's try out some of our new chips, though. 
So I want, I want corn shoot. Whatever the heck that is. Um, I want Golem hit for sure. That sounded really good. Let's see. Get rid of crack shot. Recap 50 in place of cup 30. One little boiler in there. I don't care about area grab anymore in that sword. I'm done with that. Throw in a long sword. Actually, that was a good sword. We want that. Oh yeah, we want heat man for sure. I'll try that for now. Battle chips are in display in the showcase. These chips are wanted by net battlers everywhere. Table where you can place chips. Use it when you trade chips with a friend, it seems. Welcome to Asterland. I am the shop informational program. Is there something you'd like to ask? Trader. Which trader? Chip trader? If you give the... Okay. So that's about normal. Number trader, if you enter eight lotto numbers into the number trader, you'll receive an item that matches those numbers. Lotto numbers are written here and there, so make sure to look around. Request BBS, the screen behind me is displaying the request BBS. The BBS lists the request of those in Cyber City who have problems. If you solve the problems on the request BBS, you'll receive a reward from the requester. But you cannot accept any request whenever you want. You can only request, take requests that match your rank. The first time you take a request, you'll be rank C. Uh, you receive points. You can get stars. You can only take requests with your own Navi. That Navi would be Mega Man. When you use Navis other than your own, you will not be able to interact with requesters. Okay, that's good to know. Looks like there's a new post. And I can't take these ones yet. Well, maybe we'll do one or two of those, but I doubt we're going to do too many. Hey, Land, welcome to Astroland. And that's a sunshine. Bounce the, the puck off the walls. Might not be bad. Knocks enemies two squares away. Long blade. That sounds cool. That's a lot of damage, too. Fires three square shotgun blast. Whew, excuse me. Big bomb. I'm not paying for this crap. Alright. So that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed, though. And I will see you next time for some more Mega Man Battle Network 6. Bye!